to all the folks that are in the audience that consider themselves gender dysphoria, um, cis. I don't know what all that means. I really don't know what all that means. I'm, I'm looking at society today, and it's like I'm watching an X-Men movie uh, with people that, when you watch the X-Men movies for Marvel comics, it's like we have mutants living among us on planet Earth. And, you know, some people don't like that, but that's a fact. We have people that live among us today on planet Earth that are happy to display themselves as if they were mutants from another planet. This is the planet Earth, where God created men, male, and women, female. I'm a proud Christian conservative Republican. I'm not on the fence. Not on the fence. And this bill is about public safety. It's about public safety because, as the sponsor of the bill said, we have children that have been assaulted in bathrooms. Our job as lawmakers is to do our best to protect those in our society that can't protect themselves, and that is our children. For that reason, I am up on this bill, and I thank again Representative Plakin for having the courage to bring this bill. I'm not on the fence, not one bit. And, and I'm offended that people can come before this committee and, and try to intimidate us and try to strike fear into us. It's time to push back. There is so much darkness in our world today. So much evil in our world today. And so many people who are afraid to address the evil, the dysphoria, the dysfunction. I'm not afraid to address the dysphoria or the dysfunction. The Lord rebuke you, Satan, and all of your demons and all of your imps who come and parade before us. That's right, I called you demons and imps who come and parade before us and pretend that you are part of this world. So I'm, I'm saying my righteous indignation is stirred. I am sick and tired of this. We, I'm not going to put up with it. You can test me and try to take me on but I promise you I'll win every time. Let's all vote up on this bill. Thank you.